All right, we're going to take a look at the summer solstice and I'll tell you what we've got the longest day of the year coming up tomorrow. Let's explain this. So you know, we're enjoying the sunshine. We've got our solar system out there and we'll start off way out there at the far reaches of the solar system. We'll pass Saturn. There goes Jupiter, Mars. There's Earth. All right, so we've stopped at our planet and we've got the Earth tilted, right? Its axis is tilted and this is the time of year when the Earth the northern half of the Earth, the northern hemisphere is tilted towards the sun's direct light. So the sun, 23.5 north, the Tropic of Cancer, all right, and that means shorter days are coming after the summer solstice. Our days get shorter and shorter. To this point, they've been getting longer and longer. You've noticed sunlight earlier in the morning. It's been staying lighter later and later into the evening. Well, that changes starting tomorrow. So the actual solstice occurs 513 between 513 and 514 tomorrow morning. We're going to have 14 hours of daylight, 14 hours and 41 minutes of daylight. And then after that, we will see the days getting shorter and shorter.